Okay, the next bag is bag E and G. Bag E is the slipper clutch assembly. It's a very quick bag by the looks of it. So we will be doing bag E and G in this video. Let's dive into it. Okay, well, right off the bat it includes two spur gears. That's pretty nice. So first I'm going to take this funky sized bout drive piece. Unscrew the little cap here. going to install bearings on one side bearing on the other and there's the assembled slipper clutch just like that in about eight minutes okay now I can set this to the side and let me grab out the F me bag out or grab out bag F and we'll get started just jump right into this Bag F is the steering assembly. First thing on the list is assembly of the servo saver. Okay, now I'm kind to of grab the spring and the adjuster nut and just turn it on up. And it says to have it have the bottom of the adjuster nut three millimeters from the bottom of the shaft. All right, now that's assembled. I can take this link, plastic link, and connect it. Okay, now that that's assembled, you've got to make sure that they're nice and free. Don't over tighten it, otherwise it'll stiffen everything up, and that's not good. Now I can take out my carbon fiber pieces, start assembling the rest of it according to the manual. First off, I need a 3 by 8 millimeter flathead screw, which looks like there's only one of them and that'll hold the body mount on. I recommend putting a body clip into the post. Holding on the body clip makes it a lot easier to screw in. Okay, now that that moves freely and is on, carbon mount can make the turnbuckles, the last ones. Okay, we're both at about 20 29.6, needs to be 29.4. I'll get it in once I put the card, or put it on the card. Pop them on the ball stud. Those are adjusted. Next step is to build one last turnbuckle. That will be for the servo arm itself. So 
installing this carbon plate on top, going together nicely. Really like this floating servo mount idea and design. Keep pres preserve your servo a little bit longer. Alright, now there's the servo, Savox 1258, 1257 TG in this one anyway, in the floating servo mount. Nice setup. Next page. Aha! Now that is everything for bag F, bag E and F. So thank you for watching. The next video will be bag G, the final bag, the chassis assembly. I personally am very excited for that one because that means I finally get a full car. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, Slow Ben, out.